wanted to give you a quick update on my indoor 3d printed beehives uh, I've got these covers over them just so it'll stay good and dark inside the, the hive uh, I haven't posted an update since uh, last fall and during the winter they've done really good they reduced their numbers down tremendously during the winter I guess so they there wasn't a whole lot for them to do so but now that it's about March the 16th and the population has exploded they this section here was full of honey and I noticed now they've started drinking the honey and have started putting brood in here so I have started feeding them some sugar water since I noticed they were starting to eat the, the honey this section here is completely full of honey and both of the two bottom sections were full like this uh, throughout the winter I didn't harvest it last fall I just left it in case they needed to eat it during the winter so but they've they've done really good here this spring as soon as it warmed up their their numbers started increasing I haven't seen the the queen but she's in here somewhere because there's a lot of freshly laid eggs in here and there's a lot of brood so I know she's in there somewhere there's a couple layers behind here that you can't see that she may be in behind it or she could be up in the the flow hive section this is the the flow hive section here there's not a lot going on in there I opened up my flow hive to, and tried to drain anything out of it last fall and nothing came out of it so for whatever reason they're not putting honey up here they there are a lot more in the back of the hive that you can't see I'll show you a shot of that in a minute uh, but this is the the feeders that I have put outside the window I put one feeder out there and it's with a quart jar and they emptied it the every day I put it out there for two or three days and they kept emptying it every single day so I've added two jars out there and now they're emptying two jars every day so they're they're really hungry these uh, feeders are 3d printed as well I didn't design this uh, feeder I got it off of uh, thingiverse so if you're interested in in this kind of a feeder you can go on there and download it and print it And this is my uh, flow flow hive and looking down from the end of it it's kind of hard to see up in there because it's hard to get the light up in there but there's a lot of bees towards the back side of it not sure exactly what they're doing but they're working in there there's a few little spots that I've seen where it looks like they're starting to put a little honey in there there's one little spot up there towards the top Yeah, that little cell there you can see it looks like it's got a little little honey in it so hopefully they're going to start putting the the honey in there so i just wanted to give you an update like i said it's about March the 16th of 2024 and this is my second year of having my bees inside the first year the queen died off at the end of the summer but I started over the next year and this winter they have survived and done really well I've been really pleased with how they've turned out this this winter Well, I hope you enjoyed my video. If, if you liked it, just click like and subscribe and I'll keep you updated. Thanks for watching.